So you came to One Brick Shy, and then you do Bama Dude. Mm -hmm. What happened to your self-syndication? What were the challenges you faced? Uh, the people that I was submitting to just didn't like the second strip nearly as well. It was, uh, the characters were rather reprehensible. You know, it was kind of dirty looking. I mean, the plaster was falling off the walls and the carpet was ripped and they were bad parents. And um, so they weren't as knocked out with it. You know, they hated it, I guess, would be the nice way to put it, the honest way to put it. So, Did they pull or did you decide you were just going to stop doing the strip? I kept running the strip up until 2000. I, I Pulling the strip really coincided with leaving the newspaper business. I was sick and tired of working at a newspaper. By this time, I was working at uh, a morning paper. I didn't like the hours as well. And uh, there wasn't anything left working in a newsroom that I wanted to do or was qualified to do. And I got tired of being in the newspaper business. So uh, in... January 2000, I, I just said, I'm going to go as a freelance illustrator. And, uh, you know, the second strip wasn't very popular. So it, there wasn't any, and it didn't make enough money for me to uh, warrant keeping it, keeping, going, keeping it going. So uh, I just quit, you know, I mailed them all a letter and said, I'm going to be cease publication of syndication of this as of this date. And no one begged me to keep it going, so that was it. You know, when I left the newspaper business, I, I left the cartooning. And that was done. We're, so you continued with the illustrating. Right, for two years. For two years after leaving the newspaper. Well, I continued. I, I was a freelance illustrator for two years. That's what I did. And uh, in 2002, I met my partners, and we opened another business together, and that became my primary function until recently you know I, I still work in that business but we I, I that business didn't call for a lot of illustration so I was doing design work uh, we specialize in making backstage passes and so that was what my primary function was a lot of times they submit the artwork to you you just strip it up and lay it out for print and that was uh, the primary function of the art department in the beginning what do you think your biggest challenge was with just personally continuing with self-syndication? Well, it was, uh, it, it, was, it was disheartening after a while. I mean, there just was no money in it. I remember whenever I left the paper, I actually offered to, uh, I said, you know, do you like the cartoon? And they said, yeah, we love running it. And I said, uh, well, how about you pay me uh, $10 a month? It was $2.50 a cartoon. And he said, no, it's not in the budget. And, you know, I'd been doing this for uh, nine years. And I was like, you know, there's not even $120 a year in this for me. And uh, that was pretty uh, disenchanting. Were you trying to get connected to some of the international distributors, syndicates? Yeah, they never were. You know, doing a single panel is actually, uh, it's, a, it's a numbers game. There's just more strips. There's more places for strips for, you know, multi-panel cartoons in a newspaper on their comics page than there are uh, single panels. Like, you might have four single panels, but uh, a dozen multiple-panel strips. So it's a harder sell for a syndicate. They're just not as interested in that type of format as there's not as many places for them to slot it in. It's much harder for them to get that going. Did you stop drawing altogether, or did you continue sketching things but just not putting it out to the public? No, I pretty much quit for nine years. I just didn't have time. And, you know, I drew every day when I was in the newspaper business. And uh, so I, it's the busman or, the you know, the cobbler's children. You know, it's like it was the last thing I wanted to do when I got home. So, uh, no, I, I, didn't, I didn't draw anything. And uh, the surprising thing is... I didn't miss drawing. 